Hello and welcome back to another episode of Crayon Gods. Let's get our crayon. Alright, so today we're doing something I'm very excited about. We are playing the pre-alpha tech test of Titanfall 2. Uh, it is on Xbox right now in a, like I said, a pre-alpha uh, tech test. And... Uh, so yeah, I got to try it out a little bit and play a little bit of the multiplayer. So uh, let's let's uh, let's look at this. Um, right away, I felt that it felt very similar to um, uh, how the first Titanfall felt uh, with the with the combat and with how the mobility and everything worked. The mechanics felt very similar, uh, like in Titanfall One. There was a high emphasis put on the mobility of the pilot, um, you know, just being able to move around a lot, and, uh, you know, nothing you see will hamper you, but rather is more of a tactical, tactical thing, I guess, and if you see a building, you can climb on top of it and use it as a sniping route, uh, or you can, you know, quickly get around it to get to the other side very fast, using wall runs and your double jump and whatnot. Uh, in Titanfall 2, uh, they actually increased this mobility by adding the grappling hook, as you can just see there, what I just did. Um, and that allows you to, not all of the classes have it, but a lot of them do. Um, it allows you to quickly traverse areas fast, um, and you know you can cover great distances really quickly by just grappling to the top of a building, and suddenly you're at the top. Um, so that's, been re that's a really interesting addition that they've added. Um, just in terms of speed, it, it's it's a fast moving it's a fast moving shooter, uh, so it's it's a, more along the lines of you know Call of Duty or um, yeah Call of Duty Black Ops that kind of thing. It's that that kind of speed, which I really like. Um, what you just saw there is a new version of what I'm guessing the replacement of the cards will be in the first Titanfall. You had cards that you got when you leveled up, and you could buy them, and they allowed you to, you know, amp, amp your weapons, uh, just increase all your all your abilities and whatnot. Um, but I, it, you eventually level or you get something called amp weapons, and then you 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 know hit that cell phone looking thing, and then you get an amp, you get like an increased weapon. I'm not entirely sure how it all works. Um, but yeah, that's that looks like it's the replacement for what the cards would be, which I like because I found the cards confusing. Um, yeah, what else can I say about this? Um, it's very fast. Um, I'm really, I really like the, the speed of the gameplay. Um, I kind of suck at it still, but you know, it's it's fun. Um, right now, because it is still in the alpha uh, pre pre alpha tech test. It is quite, um, oh, sure. well, it's glitchy at times, you know. There was a couple times where I was trying to get into a game and then it just, like, everything froze and glitched out. And it just, it just didn't work amazingly. I find once you're in the game, though, it works out pretty good. Uh, I didn't have any, didn't have any glitch issues or anything like that. There you can see the grappling hook really well, you know, getting across that huge, huge area fast and effectively. Um... One thing that I've realized in this new game is sonar, which I found really annoying. Um, I'm not really sure how to interact with it, but it looks like some sort of, um, you know, it, it allows the it allows the uh, enemy to to see see people uh, on their screen, and you can kind of see on my radar. There's a little bit of the red there. And yeah, I got shot. Um, they have a really fun slide mechanic. You know, when you're sprinting and then you crouch, you do this really long slide. And I mean, a lot of games have that, but I find that this one, uh, in in Titanfall 2, uh, it's a much longer slide, and if you have like a lot of momentum, you can really slide for a long time, which is fun because you know that just adds another another element, another dynamic to the multiplayer gameplay and uh, how you interact with other pilots. Sadly, I did not in this game mode. I did not get to test out the um, the Titan mechanics. I didn't get to see how those are different. They they uh, took some of that out for this weekend, and I also haven't played all the game modes, but um, I'm really looking forward to actually getting into a Titan. This was just the pilot-on-pilot -pilot mechanics, 
Um, and we have a couple maps here. This one, this one's fun. It's um, very dynamic. One thing I have noticed though is that uh, I find because there's so much stuff as a pilot you can do, you can wall run, you can climb the walls. Uh, some people can even hook onto the walls while they're while they're wall running, so that you can kind of have that roost. Um, it sometimes gets a little bit confusing as to what you're trying to do. In that situation, you saw me grapple, and I think I actually wanted to do a grenade. <laughs> so that's you know that's just my mistake, getting confused as to which bumpers, which which uh, which weapon and uh, function there. So. Uh, but yeah, I found that like, you know, sometimes you're trying to just, you know, jump over a wall and sometimes you start wall running and then it, you know, it gets kind of awkward because you're you're not moving up, you're moving across the wall. So, I don't know if they'll fix that or tweak that at all in the in the release. That was the one thing I didn't like about the mobility. But that grappling hook, I'm I just I just love. Um, and I love how you know, you can just get from place to place super quickly, get some really good tactical advantages on people. Um, yeah, like, I, like what I tried there didn't really work, but you know, I tried to come in from above, kind of come in fast with the grappling hook so I could shoot the guy. <laughs> um, didn't work, but you know. So here's the amped weapons, like I said before. So you click that, and then suddenly your weapon is a little bit boosted, um, which is fun. Didn't work out for me there, but you know, I can't get them all. Ah, uh, what else can I say? Um,. The, I like how you can, uh, like, even in the tech test here, you can already upgrade your pilot and stuff. They have a lot of that in there. It's not, it's not a, you can kind of see where the game will be going. You can get different weapons. You can increase your buffs and your perks. Um, there you could really, you could see the nice long slide that that guy um, had. Which, which I really enjoy because you can kind of, you can get from place to place really quickly in a, in a more covered way. Oh, and uh, so, like in the other Titanfall game, there is a, when you lose the battle, whatever team loses the battle has the option to get to a dropship, um, which I find is a really cool added, like a really cool feature to a multiplayer game, because then it feels like, alright, we've lost the battle, but let's get, let's get our troops out here. And so, like you can see there at the top, it says get to the dropship, and then uh, I have that beacon on the screen where it tells me to go. And um, I really like that feature because you know it, get, it allows you to get those couple more kills, even though you even though you've uh, been fine. defeated, and to get to the drop ship. And it's you know it's a it's a great last kind of push. All the bad guys go there, or uh, enemy team, and all your team goes. Um, I didn't know how to get in, so I kind of just I well, there you go. I, I get the grenade again instead of grappling, but then I grappled in, and so I made it to the drop ship. I think I was the only one this game. Um, but yeah, that was uh, that was some Titanfall 2 at the pre-alpha tech test. Let me know what you think about the game. Uh, are you gonna get it? Are you gonna, do you have it pre-ordered already? Uh, let me know what you think of this and what you'd like to see or what you wouldn't like to see. Leave a comment and uh, yeah, have a great day. Thanks for watching.